This is something a little interesting. I live in New Mexico. We have very hard water. We don't have pool. At least I don't have a pool. But I bought a pool cover pump. Because I'm going to make a pool cover without a pool. The pool cover is what actually gave me the idea. What happens? You know, you put a cover over your pool for the off season and it fills with water. Well, that's where this comes in. You plug this in and you sit this in the center of your pool cover. At 1.6 inches it turns on, at 0.6 inches it turns off. This way it's not going to kill itself. Um, this is basically to keep leaves and debris and crap out of it so that you don't clog up your pump. It sucks in through the bottom. It ejects out through here. You have different fittings for what kind of a hose you want it to attach to. It comes with one hose. And I'm going to actually put out a giant pool cover, essentially. Put this in the middle of it whenever it rains. Now I can capture that rainwater and pump it into a barrel and use it. Because rainwater is naturally soft. And this is a very cheap way of doing exactly that. Capturing that rain. Because I have limited roof area to capture water. But I have a one and a quarter acres. You put out a few, you know, 400 square foot tarps with one of these in the middle of each. And, you know, that 15 minute rainstorm might actually give you a pretty decent amount of water. So, that's the idea. I'm going to use a pool cover a pump on top of a pool cover without an actual pool. But I'm going to intentionally capture the water with the pool cover and then use this to do exactly what it was designed to do. Empty that water out, put it somewhere else. In my case, into a rain barrel. Pretty neat. This thing is heavy duty. Nice, very long cord. Uh, it's supposed to be automatic. You plug it in, you let it run. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to leave the tarps out because they're going to collect bugs and leaves and stuff like that. So when I know rain's coming, unfold them. Plop this bad boy in the middle, plug it in, and once the water level comes up to 1.6 inches, the pump kicks on and fills up my barrel. Pretty darn neat. And legit brass fittings, too. So there's your brass barb. That brass one right there is likely what you would use for this. Pretty darn neat.